I feel silly saying this whole thing again because I clearly explained this yesterday but then something went down which I'll talk to you guys in a bit just because I'm running late but long story short we're gonna fix this mess today and you guys are in for the journey I have my contacts on which I usually hate I wish I could show you my hair better but it's up in a ponytail because I'm literally sick of it but yeah, good thing is we're gonna go and fix it today. Finger crossed because I literally said the same thing yesterday. Pull the clips back. So as you guys can tell, it's been quite a while since I went to the hairdresser. I think last time that I got my hair done was in March. Right before I went to Edinburgh and ever since then I let it grow and I definitely did mess it up with it, trying to like get it lighter. I don't really know where this vlog is going because I do get quite shy once I'm in there so probably not gonna vlog a whole lot of it but I just wanted to show you guys the before so that we can review the after later yeah as you can tell my hair is pretty dark I still have some blonde bits at the very end but the top part is pretty much my natural color Unless the sun is out. Well, I'm at home right now. I hate it. I hate it, guys. I hate it. I just... I want to cry. I already cried yesterday because of my hair and I feel like I want to cry again I asked for a balayage and I put together like this whole you know hair mood board thingy this is nothing like my insta pic at all not only the tone is different which fair enough my hair is low warm tone so I can understand that but I hate fucking baby lights I just hate them and she literally did have a full head of baby lights Okay, so it's the following day. I'm currently in the kitchen. I'm just gonna make something for lunch and then I'll speak with you guys about my hair because I do need to finish this vlog even though I'm not really pleased with it. So yeah, let's just make lunch first, shall we? I'm gonna make a little salad. go this is definitely one of my favorite salads mm. so this is definitely not the type of video that I've planned but here we are I feel like I've introduced this video already but it definitely feels weird to sit down in front of a camera without saying hey guys and welcome back to my channel so I think I'm gonna keep that in Anyway, I feel like I've postponed this talk for as much as I could because I don't know what to say and also because I generally want to cry. So let me just explain the situation a sec. I was meant to get my hair done on Monday and I went there, waited like 40 minutes in the chair and then the guy told me, hey, I don't know what happened to your stylist but she's not picking up her phone so we're not sure whether or not she will come in today and so I'm like, well, great there's nothing that I love more than waste my time and then the guy suggested to reschedule it for the following day and I feel like that's where I went wrong because I 
definitely could have asked for a discount I mean this is gonna sound so dramatic but when I go back I literally had a full-on breakdown I started crying and sobbing I was so excited to get my hair fixed that day and the fact that it didn't happen it just put me in a very bad mood so yeah that happened and then the following day as you guys saw I got ready and I went to the hairdresser once again and she sort of did my hair I feel like I didn't have a great experience whatsoever we barely talked like she wasn't good at picking up conversations at all it's time to talk about the elephant in the room that is my hair at this point other than the cat that looks great with the little curtain bangs soft layers and all of that other than that this is definitely not what i asked for i asked for a balayage she literally gave me baby highlights and i hate for the life of me, I hate baby highlights. I ask for baby highlights on my first ever session in this hair salon and I realized it was my bad because that's not what I wanted by the time I thought it was. So I had baby highlights in the past and I despise them very much. But here I am with baby highlights that I didn't ask for. So. I know that I should have told her straight away that I do not like the results and probably I should still call the salon and be like hey I'm not happy with my hair because I spent 160 pounds and let me tell ya after 160 pounds I definitely expect to be super happy with my hair and I'm not and I know that I'm making such a big deal out of it like it doesn't look bad I mean compared to how my hair was it's definitely a good improvement and it looks good it's just it's not what I asked for and I am very upset she didn't blow dry my hair entirely like she just did this part like this front piece that looks good and then the back is like literally my natural hair she, she just didn't bother with it and I'm like that is so weird so this was meant to be a hair transformation vlog instead I feel like it's a hair fail vlog or something like that I really hope it was some sort of entertaining for you guys but yeah I think I'm gonna cut this video short if you're not subscribed yet be sure to do that for a brand new cover every Tuesday and a main channel sort of video every Friday and with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!